Hey everybody. Hello everyone. Mo and Dam here. Some of us are trying to lose a few pounds and you know how hard that is. You know how hard that I is. I do. I do. And also in going along with the seasonal berry right now, strawberries. Yes. yes. We got so something great to do. We do have something great for you today. It's called a strawberry feta salad. So, how, how do we make that strawberry feta salad? Do you like spinach in your salad? I do. I love yes. a good spinach salad, y'all. I didn't used to, but I, I've grown to really love them. So we're going to use just baby spinach leaves, <laughs> baby spinach leaves, and I'm just going to put them in my bowl Ta -da! like this. Those look bigger than babies. <laughs> they do. These are some big babies, but I always get, look here, that is not a spinach leaf. Oh, it's leaf. not. What is that? <laughs> anyway, um, so I'm just going to That's a spring. That should have been in the spring mix. Yeah, I think so. I think they got it mixed up. Yeah. So there we go. Now, y'all, I'm going to tell you something. I'm one of these people. I don't like this long stem on my spinach. I feel like I'm a cow eating in the yard. <laughs> <laughs> you know, so a lot of times I will pull those long ones off because I just don't like them. But this one didn't have too many of those. And then, and then if you get a little wilty spinach leaf, I pull those out too. I just don't like the big long stems like that. But that's just me. It don't do bother me. I don't it think don't bother so. Deb, so I'm not going to worry about it too much today. But anyway, so there's your spinach. Ta-da! Let's turn the camera down so we we're can gonna turn this camera down just a little bit. Mix up. Now, all we're going to add is we're going to add one tablespoon. You can use olive oil. I have avocado oil, so that's what I'm going to add. I'm just going to drizzle it over it. Just like that. And now I'm going to add two tablespoons of this wonderful balsamic white vinegar. White balsamic vinegar. White balsamic vinegar. I don't love the dark. I, just, I had never had white till recently, and I love well, the Deb, white. Deb I'm brought me, sold. where did you find this? Amazon. On Amazon. So she, she gave me a bottle of it, and it is wonderful, y'all. So two tablespoons of that go in. Now to that, we're going to add... <laughs> One eighth teaspoon, which is not a lot. Let's get it back in that bowl. We're gonna add one eighth teaspoon of ground black pepper. And I like pepper a lot, so I'm gonna add a little more. What do you think about that? I think it's a great idea. Because make it yours. We can. Okay. Now we're gonna add one cup of chopped walnuts. These are not chopped real fine, they're just kind of coarsely chopped. I'm gonna add those to the top. La la. And then we're going to add one half cup of the wonderful feta cheese. This is the fat-free feta. Did you know that? I did not know there was a fat-free. Mm -hmm. Tastes the same to me. If I can save a little fat, then let's do it. All right, now Deb is going to slice up some berries, y'all. Some strawberries. What a cute little berry bowl. Strawberries. Isn't that, isn't that cute? So let's set out our strawberries. How many berries do you need? We need two cups. Two cups. So pretty much all of these, you think? I think so. Do you want me just to cut them and drop them and pour them in? Yep. You're not going to try to measure them or nothing? Nope. Okay. Whoops. All right. So, so we've got a, a little slicer here. It's called the cup slicer from Pampered Chef. And we're just going to slice. Slice and dice. Them, uh, slice and dice, yes. Fill up the cup. And it's about a cup full. Yeah, it is. When you slice, get it filled up. So, and in they go. The strawberries. And y'all look, they're all sliced the same size. And I love that. And such a time saver, too. I mean, two minutes <laughs> or less to slice up two cups of strawberries. That's crazy. One less one. If you don't have one of these cup slicers, you need to get you one. Deb can hook you up, y'all. Yeah. We'll set up a link. Okay. There you go. Thank you, Deb. A bowl full of berries. Okay, y'all. Now, I could not find my wonderful salad tongs. I don't know why. 
but I'm going to use a regular tones in a minute, but I, I needed something a little bigger. So I'm just going to start tossing this, hopefully not in the floor. Hopefully mm, not mm, in the floor. Boy, that's going to be good. This is our lunch, y'all. It's Saturday. We need a good healthy lunch. Boy, it smells good, too. Probably could have used a bigger bowl, huh? Maybe. You about got it, though. I have a thing about that. I never pick the right <laughs> size bowl, do I? Oh, Boy, my. this is going to be good. It smells so good. Y'all, you better get you some strawberries and uh -huh. Make spinach and give this salad a try. Make this salad while the strawberries are good and fresh. Yeah. Nice. Now, some of y'all probably can have strawberries year-round that are taste homegrown or whatever. All right, I think that looks great. Mm. There's a strawberry feta salad. That looks amazing. Okay. So, y'all, what do you think? We're going to have this for lunch. It's going to be good make you this feta strawberry feta salad strawberry feta salad with spinach leaves yeah it's really good and so healthy too give it a try y'all bye see you later